Hi friends, this is Mohammed Shakil here and this is a tutorial to design a hair dryer cover in Kitia V5. So in this tutorial I'm going to use the part design and wireframe and surface design workbench. And on the right side of the screen in the Kitia software you can see the complete design of the hair dryer cover. And on the left side you can see the different drawings which are required to complete the design. So we are uh, almost uh, complete with the design you can see this is the uh, file which we are working on so if you haven't if this is the first part that you are gonna watch you are watching then please go back to my channel and find out find out the uh, first tutorial which I've created uh, which actually start from the scratch alright so let's uh, join all of the parts all of the surfaces together in this part so just click on the join command and select all the fill commands which you have used and then use select the trim so that's all just click on OK and that's done so if you go to the specification tree and if you click on the join it should actually show that the complete uh, design is being selected like this so if it is so then your design is perfect now select the join so before getting into any further just select all the sketches let's beautify our sketch our design now and I'll hide all of them all of the planes because we don't want them anymore hide okay hide now this one too hide now let's just get back to the part design workbench and go to the insert surface base feature and close surface you'll get this option here no worry just click on OK and select the join option which we have used click on OK and you're not gonna see any changes in this because uh, actually the solid body is being created but it's under the join or the surface so just hide this and you'll find the uh, the solid part being created uh, let's see some further things we're gonna work uh, with this particular part in the next part of the tutorial and if you have any doubts on this particular part of the tutorial please uh, comment below on my video what your doubt is and if you want me to handle any CAD projects you can always write to me at ktia.pro.user at gmail.com and I'll be getting in touch with you as soon as I find time and that's all for this particular part stay tuned thank you